Hello friends, I am Sudhir and you are enjoying the YouTube channel English Carnival A Journey of Learning with Joy. Friends, today we are going to explore some important multiple choice questions based on the poem called Road Not Taken, composed by the most popular American poet and the winner of four Pulitzer Prizes. Yes, that is Robert Frost. But friends, before we proceed, as usual, I request you to subscribe to this channel by just pressing the subscribe button and hitting the bell icon so that you may get the notifications of uploaded such academic videos on this particular channel called English Carnival in coming days. Friends, here Robert Frost was an American poet and he was one of the most popular figures of the 20th century. Friends, his poems express the portrait of the ordinary people and their routine lives and their typical situations that they come across in their day-to-day -day lives. Friends, as far as this poem or this composition called The Road Not Taken is concerned, it was first published in August 1915 and this poem talks about people's choices which are unique and brave and they greatly create impact on the course of life or some decisions of our lives. Friends, the main theme of this poem is about making choices and that's it. Friends, in fact, making choice is not the only theme of this poem, but it is also about praising the choice of the non-conformist, someone who goes outside the box to think or risk taker or some people who prefer to take risk in their lives. So friends, let us move and see some important multiple choice questions based on Robert Frost's interesting composition called The Road Not Taken. So let us move and see the first question we have. We have the first question. Robert Frost was a or an dash poet. Options are American, Canadian, Swiss, Australian. The correct answer is A and he was an American poet. Question number two we have Robert Frost was born on dash. Options are 25th March 1874, 26th March 1874, 27th March 1874 and 28th March 1874. Correct answer is B and he was born on 26th March 1874. Question number three we have the poem speak, speaks about dash. Options are about the plight of roads, about the people, about two roads, about the choices made by people. Correct answer is D and this poem talks about the choices made by people. Question number four we have, what do the roads signify in the poem? Options are, the path of choice that was left or not chosen to road. Second, B, the pathway, C, the pathway on the roadside and D, a road with two turns. Correct answer is A and it is the path of choice that was left or not chosen to road. Question number five we have dash decides the person's future according to the poet or Robert Frost. Options are the path one chooses to walk, the path one leaves behind, the regrets and the success. Correct answer is A and it is the path one chooses to walk. Question number six we have dash is the message of the poem. Options are be wise while choosing and taking decisions, two roads are confusing Road is nothing but a pathway and last all of the above. Correct answer is A and it is B wise while choosing and taking decisions. Question number seven we have, why the poet asks to be wise while choosing a pathway? Options are A, because there is no option of going back. B, because it is the only, uh, because it is the only one road. C, because it is one sided road and D, none of these. Correct answer is A and it is because there is no option of going back. Question number 8 we have, diverge means dash. Options are A, to be separated and taking a different turn. B, to be torn. C, to break and D, all of the above. Correct answer is A and it is to be separated and taking a different turn. Question number 9 we have, why was the poet able to travel one road only? Options are A because he had to walk alone, B because he had no vehicle, C because he was one person and D all of the above. Correct answer is C and it is because he was one person. Question number 10 we have yellow woods mean dash. Options are A 
Falling leaves B. Forest with yellow leaves in the autumn season C. Wood yellow in color and D. None of these Correct answer is B and it is forest with yellow leaves in the autumn season Question number 11 we have What do yellow woods represent in the poem? Options are A. People B. Older people C. Poets and D. Choice Correct answer is B and it indicates or represents older people Question number 12 we have, why was the poet looking at path? Options are A, to decide whether it was suitable for him or not. B, to see how long it was. C, to check it. And D, none of these. Correct answer is A and it is to decide whether it was suitable for him or not. Question number 13 we have, poet's long stare at the path signifies dash. Options are A, the time taken by people to decide and making a choice. B, poet loves nature. C, relaxing hours. D, none of these. Correct answer is A and it is the time taken by people to decide and making a choice. Question number 14 we have, what does grassy means? Options are A, the road which is not used by anyone. B, the comfortable road. C, the road with all luxuries. And D, well built road. Correct answer is A and it is the road which is not used by anyone. Question number 15 we have, where does the poet find himself? Options are A, on the road, on a bus, on a muddy road and D, on a fork. The correct answer is D and it is on a fork. Question number 16 we have, what shows that the road has not been used by many people? Options are A, the green and untrampled grass on it. B. The mud on it, C. The broken stones on it, and D. All of the above. Correct answer is A, and it is the green and untramp untrampled grass on it. Question number 17 we have What does the choice of road signify? Options are A. Too many things, B. Two paths, C. Toughness of choice and decision in life, and D. None of these. Correct answer is C, and it is toughness of a choice and decision in life. Question number 18 we have, why did the poet choose the second road? Options are A, because it was well built. B, because it was beautiful. C, because it was not used by many people and was appealing to the poet. And D, all of the above. Correct answer is C and it is because it was not used by many people and was appealing to the poet. Question number 19 we have, what do the words long I stood means in the poem? The options are A, poet's dilemma. B, Poet was in relaxing mood. C. Poet was enjoying the nature. And D. Poet was thinking. The correct answer is A and it is Poet's Dilemma. Question number 20 we have. Dash was the dilemma of the poet. Options are A. Whether he will be able to come back to the second road or not. B. Whether he will get time for himself. C. Whether he will be successful. And D. Whether he will be able to walk. Correct answer is A and it is whether he will be able to come back to the second road or not. Question number 21 we have, what does the poet's decision of taking less traveled road signify? Options are A, poet's risk taking habit, B, arrogance of the poet, C, poet's curiosity and D, none of these. Correct answer is A and it is poet's risk taking habit. Question number 22 we have, the road symbolizes the road of dash. Options are A. Heaven, B. Better future, C. Life and D. Past memories. Correct answer is C and it is life. Question number 23 we have Robert Frost died in dash. Options are A. 1964, B. 1965, C. 1963 and D. 1964. Correct answer is C and he died in 1963. So friends, all these are the multiple choice questions based on Robert Frost's popular composition called The Road Not Taken. I hope friends you have liked all these multiple choice questions discussed in this video in this presentation and if you have really liked it, I request you to like it, share it among your friends near and dear ones as well. Friends if you are a new viewer to this channel then I request you to subscribe to this channel by just pressing the subscribe button and hitting the bell icon so that you may get the notifications of uploaded such academic videos on this particular channel called English Carnival in coming days. So friends we will meet soon again with a different video on different piece of literature. Till then friends, just take care of yourself and be happy. Thank you very much.